Hello and welcome gamers to Halo Clans for today's interview. Today's interview is with some representatives from Central Fleet, uh, NH, NSTH, and Black Death 627, uh, leaders and co-leaders of Central Fleet. Uh, so uh, why don't you guys give us a little bit of your clan history? Alright, um, Black Death, do you want to say anything? Or... You can start us off. Okay. Um, Central Fleet originally started, uh, I'm going to say around the beginning of Reach. Um, it was supposed to be based off the Spartan 2 Fire Team Green Team. Um, it's had numerous names in the community. Um, we are on Generation 6, so uh, this is Central Fleet. Um, it was originally known as Green Team Space Command at one point. Then, ever since... GTSC, we've been trying hard to come back and everything. So, it's had a lot of names in the past couple of years. It's had so, Naval yeah. Warfare, CENTCOM, Cinder Fleet, stuff like that. Yeah. What is your current member count at? Okay. So, on, with the Marines, there's approximately 43 plus the members not on the roster. We have approximately four ODSTs, then 13 Spartan 2s within the program. What are your guys' current clan goals? To try, well, uh, personally, the clan's goal in my eyes is just not to get involved in things unless we're 100% needed in situations. Um, we technically are involved in a lot of things, but the main thing right now is just a personal goal is to get back up to full strength like we did back in Gen 1 because of my former second in command at that time. Um, that's my goal. Uh, Black Death. I say yeah. it's uh, just to grow, in my opinion, just to branch out and stuff. Just be a big clan in general. Fair enough. Uh, what has been your guys' toughest fight so far? Uh, could you repeat that? What has been your guys' toughest fight so far? I I don't really think the toughest fight we've had within all six generations. I, I'm gonna have to be about. I'm gonna have to say Generation 4's war against InGen was by far the hardest. Because Gen 4 started. Because me and Black Death. Um, Black Death and I have known each other for years. He's actually been through every generation of the clan. Um, he helped me restart Generation 4. Um. Basically what happened was me and him were both in a clan called Ghost of Reach. Um, me and him both led the Marines in Ghost of Reach. Uh, there was an insurrectionist clan called InGen up and they had been messing with the entire UNSC community. Now, cause I was a pretty big UNSC kid at the time. I, I was not happy. So I, I left GOR to fight InGen. Um, the sad thing is though, we do one raid with them, it lasted about six hours, that was our very first raid loss. Then after that, I just started focusing on building Marines up, because standby was complete shit. Um, it changed later on, um, later on, engine fell, shortly after the Generation 4 fell, when we became military base, because... There, we couldn't pull lobbies, we couldn't do what we were doing. We had about 19 people in army and 10 people in special forces and we were all gonna go into army and everything. But thus ultimately I chose to end the clan because we couldn't continue the way we were going on. So, right. um, Do you guys have any allies outstanding? Um, yes, um, the Divine Republic is one of them, 
Uh, their Divine Republic consists of people also from GOR. Um, then our other ally is actually in certain instruction is climb so to per se i don't know how to explain that he says he's not insurrectionist and stuff but i don't really know how to explain it i don't know the name of his clan though it was <laughs> set up no uh, we he asked us to help him out in a um war against one of his enemies so we ended up going to a meeting I never, I never learned the clan's name, sadly. Um, I'm probably gonna talk to one of my guys about it. But yeah. Um. <laughs> now the opposite of that question. Uh, do you have any opposition outstanding? Um. Mm -hmm. Yes, but not very. They're very not what we would, what we expected. Um, now Valhalla, uh, they were a clan that Lewis, one of my Spartans, he, he had had some problems with them, so because what I promised Lewis, because he was initially going to merge his clan, uh, a much larger clan into mine, um, I promised him any problems you have will transfer over to us and we'll help you deal with it. I promised him that. Um... He could only, he left the clan he was leading, he brought over five guys, which actually became class one for the program. Um, I planned on keeping my promise to him in fighting Valhalla. Me and about four other Spartans, you know, three, went in, and they weren't what we expected whatsoever. Um, so they're not really enemies. Um, well, we could say in H, right? Because, I mean, we kind of are. A well, bit we're still so focusing on two of the other uh, conflicts, Blacked Um The other conflict is Dark Warriors Triumph, which is led by Zeus the Great 69, oh, yeah. I believe. Um, <laughs> That's they're, they're nowhere. Um, Black Death can say what if he wants. Um, they're. Their structure is horrible. Their clan leader is horrible. He can't really even lead a clan because, like, the fact that he talks shit to most of his members and what's it called, he basically got a couple of his members to leave and come join us. So, pretty fucking life. Always trying to shit talk me, so, you know, but it didn't work out for him in the end. So, whatever. You want to explain the raid thing that happened? The one oh raid we God. actually had with them? You want to explain that? Because I'm going to start laughing if I do. I'm going to try and be serious. Oh, no. Um, so Zeus... So Zeus had been game sharing Halo 5 with one of his members. Essentially, his second in command was the only one who joined the raid. Me and the other Spartans went to talk to him. He said Zeus lost Halo 5. And the deal was, if Zeus's clan won the raid, we had to game. One of my guys had to game share Halo Five with him. So <laughs> it was kind of funny because after that, we ended up getting into a party with Zeus. Me and Black Death did, and we had a nice little fiasco going on. It was pretty funny. <laughs> Which ended up with me getting muted and still being able to talk shit to him, so. Yeah. No, um, his second in command joined us, and I haven't had time to set him up, so that's one Marine who I haven't been able to set up. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, the two conflicts we're fighting, I, I wouldn't necessarily say they're a problem, but, um, the, the only thing really have to say. I think the Valhalla one we can step out of now. We don't really need to worry about that one. Alright, uh, that actually just about wraps it up for uh, my questions. So, uh, do you guys have a question for me, or do you want to do a recruitment message? Uh, yes, recruitment message, please. Um, so, 
Also, another thing, my friend's been using my account on Reach for TNH. Um, if you're still a client, if you're still somebody who's playing Reach, um, I personally am in Fleetcom. So if you want to message my tag for both TNH or Fleetcom, feel free. But if you're somebody on Halo 5 looking to join a UNSC based clan, um, feel free to message me or Black Death. Or you can go in, on our website and message any of those guys. Um, any new member who wishes to join is welcome. Um, so yeah. All right, uh, this has been Halo Clans here with uh, representatives from Central Fleet, uh, NH, NSPH, and Black Death Two or Six Two Seven. Signing out. <laughs> okay.